Oh, hey everybody, it's Mr. Cramp. I'm here at Core Martial Arts. Hey, what I wanna go over real quick is our uh, Kyokushin Handbook. Now this is a student manual that everybody gets at white belt level. Um, we came out with this when several kids were already on their journey to black belt, and so many of you might have bought this for $5, which covered the cost of printing. But this covers everything that we go through, belt by belt, um, in terms of curriculum and requirements. So I wanna go over this just real quick. So the table of contents basically walks you through what this book is about. It goes through the protocols of a dojo. So the things that we require, how to take off your shoes, how to bow, um, some of the traditions of martial arts, and of course, um, you know, the traditions of, of our instructor staff. How to tie a belt is in here. Um, we also go through each different belt and what level they're called in uh, Japanese, which is Q, right? Q is a color belt. It talks about the history of Kyokushin and the symbology uh, that we have uh, uh, for the Kanku and for the Kanji. Then we get into each of the requirements for the belt. So at white belt, you'll see this big block. It says stripe one. Stripe one is for basics and basics always are our key hone. Those are the straight punches, the kicks, and the stances that each belt is required to know. Stripe two is our combos, our sparring combinations, or Ren Raku. At white belt, they have attack one and two, and then from yellow belt on, you'll hear it referred to as Ren Raku. The third stripe is their uh, kata, and their kata is listed right here. You can find everything that they're required to know out on our YouTube channel or on Facebook. It's clearly organized by playlists. So if you go to our YouTube channel, you can go straight to white belt curriculum. On there, you'll find those three things. You'll find the basics that they're required to know, you'll find the uh, sparring combination that they're required to know, and you'll find a step-by-step -step execution video on how to do the kata. You'll also see it done in normal speed. Lastly, for the fourth stripe, which is not really listed as a fourth stripe, but all the kids are required to do their breaking prior to testing. And this has what that break is. And what we're gonna be doing with our video content is also review how to do the break properly. We'll do it on pads and then we'll do it on rebreakable boards. And then we'll do it also with a real board. So this is our Kyokushin handbook. If you don't have one, you can stop by the dojo or ask me to leave one out for you. I'm happy to do so. Um, so let me know. Os.